Hi folks, my name is Don Mazziotti. Today we're going to be doing a walkthrough today on a 2017-273 Octane by Jayco. Come on in, we'll start on the inside and we'll finish on the outside. Let's go have some fun. So an Octane is obviously a toy hauler. You can park all your fun toys in the back here. And this is an electric setup in the rear. Basically it's got a bed on the top and then a couch on the bottom that's actually like a, like two couches facing each other that can be used as a dinette um, and or a bed and then they also tilt down and get out of the way so you can bring something a little taller in and then you've got a ramp in the back that you can drive up into and of course you can see all the tie downs in the floor now that's all remote electric right here it just glides up and down on these remote controls you got light switches for the ceilings plug-ins on both sides of the walls got ventilation so you can air out all your uh, toys and stuff and uh, of course you got some really nice windows on the side here to get some of the lighting in now you can see it's got a two burner stove by Suburban and then down here it's got a convection microwave all your drawers are full extension double double pull out type you got stainless steel sinks, beautiful cabinetry, nice and deep. And then over here you've got a Norcold six cubic foot refrigerator and freezer. And you can see up here you've got plugins and stuff for your TV setup, and then you got a panel right here that you can put the TV on. It can mount and mount right across here if you'd like. Some ventilation in the ceiling, and of course a right above the cameraman there, it's got an air conditioner. Look at him hold that camera. Alright, so there's a nice little pantry. Put some goodies over here. And you got all your control panels on this side. And you can see the LED lighting in the ceiling. Probably never have to replace those awesome low voltage. Make batteries last longer. Come on down the hallway here and the first thing we'll run into is a door on one side and a window on the other to lean some light in here. And then you'll be able to see that that's a glass enclosure shower. Nice uh, vanity set up. Then if the cameraman can go inside of there, you can look around the back side of that door. And you can see some storage over here. Okay. And then you can enter the bedroom from where he's standing. Go look in that way. And it's got a glide door and it's got another glide door on this side. And you can see that it closes off the bedroom here and does that right next to him there too. We got a full queen size walk around bed with nice little closets on both sides. And up top, you got some storage, nice vent up here. And then there's a spot for a TV on the wall right over on that side. And then the plug-ins are on the ceiling right above that there. And you do have plug-ins both sides of the bed. Anybody has sleep apnea machines or anything? You got plenty of storage there for your phones and and uh, iPads and all those other things. As you can see, there's no carpet in here, so it's a nice vinyl wood floor all the way throughout. Very well done. In fact, it's pretty amazing stuff. It looks real. So that's a ducted roof air conditioner. That air conditioner is going to go on and off with a temperature control. It's a really nice setup because it ducts throughout the whole unit. Um, let's go on the outside. We'll look at a few of the features out here, folks. As you can see, it's got a nice screen door. It's got the capability of opening the door without sliding this. I like this little feature. We'll lock it on there. And then it's got a clasp on the back of the door to keep it from swinging around. And then if you'll notice, that's a huge awning all the way across this unit, all electric. Nice setup, alloy wheels. Radial tires, nitro filled. Nice plug-ins out here for any of your stuff that you need to plug in. 
And then uh, the speakers for the sound system are on the outside too. And you can see the windows are nice and tinted. The nice thing about an aluminum siding is it's aluminum. It's not going to have any kind of corrosion. It's, uh, it's easily taken care of. Um, and uh, if you ever do pop a hole or something into it or run into something, it's easy to replace a panel. And uh, it can look brand new again. Um, right over here, got some great storage underneath the bed. And you can see while he's looking, there's the jack system that'll actually, the stabilizer jacks, scissor jacks are a very heavy duty. A lot of guys will bring their uh, Makita or, or any kind of screw drive uh, wireless and put a socket on the end of it and move those down. It goes a lot quicker. But it does come with a tool to do that. Um, you got solar on the side. That actually hooks up to a solar panel that you can utilize. It's a very easy setup. You just plug a solar panel right into it. That goes direct to the batteries. And you can see here there's a mounting system for either a generator or extra batteries or whatever you want to do. Some LED lighting up front. You got the tanks on board here with the easy access from the top so you can get in and adjust those tanks real easy. Electric front jack with a light on it so you can see what you're doing and now they are LED. Then you can see up on the top corners up there on the on the unit there's actually LED lighting now. Nice little setup. Got your sewer hose you can plug into there. And then you got that storage across all the way to here. You got your uh, batteries is where you put those right there. And our unit will come with batteries. Outside shower right here. So right after the shower we have a uh, flush for the sewer tank and that's going to flush out that toilet tank for you so you don't have to run a hose inside the unit. Then here we've got the hot water tank, six gallon hot water tank with a 7.4 gallon per hour recovery rate. Here's your city water connection. And then your plug in for your 30 amp service. You'll be able to pull that, hook, that cord right out of there and plug it in. And then you've got your cable or satellite input. And then you can fill your water tank up right here. And right here is a service station, and you'll be able to fill up your toys with the gas station. Your gas fill is right here. You got a shut off right there, and then you got a gas fill right here. And that holds, give or take, right around 30, 35 gallons of gas for most of them. And then you've got an outside ladder system right here, and that'll tilt out, and then you can climb and walk around on this roof. All on the back of it, you can see it's all LED lighting, LED tail lights. And then of course you've got the new lockable clasp. You open those up, you can tilt this deck down and of course drive your toys up on there. Anyway folks, my name's Don. You'll see a number down at the bottom here. Please give me a call. Love to help you out with any other questions you might have. I made that kind of quick, but let's see if we can help you. I'm here anytime. You can call me. Let's have a great day and don't forget, we don't just sell fun, we guarantee it. Thanks a lot.